Well, now on 7 News, the rising number of coronavirus cases is already impacting the schools. We're going to start with our Henry Coburn, who's reporting from 96. Greenwood District 52 is going back to hybrid learning, he's learned. The district's move to transition back to hybrid education comes just about two weeks after it expanded to full time in person learning. The superintendent tells me it was a tough call to make, but that this was the right choice. The decision was announced Thursday. All district schools will make the move back to hybrid on the 19th, which is next Thursday. The district started the year on a hybrid system and only transitioned to a face to face model last week. Greenwood District 52 Superintendent Dr. Rex Ward says the decisions to reopen or reclose schools hinges on the incidence rates of coronavirus within that county. For the district, the threshold to shut down was 201 new cases of coronavirus per 100,000 people over a five day average. Ward has been tracking the data and says that the return to hybrid learning was always a possibility. When we were planning to go to a five day a week, we understood there was a second wave coming through. So what we've done, we put in a metrics there to say if it reaches, uh, if it starts entering the high rate again on the two week incident rate of 201 or higher and have a five day average, then we'd make the call to go back to hybrid. Greenwood District 52 tells me they don't yet know when they're going to be able to welcome all their students back to full time face to face learning. In 96, Henry Coburn, 7 News.